have been a bit quicker, I could have avoided that. But... Well. <laughs> I do love how I can stand right here, killing this Jedi right in front of that supply officer there, and he just sits there. Guy, look at this wanker. He's sitting back here waiting for me to go in. I know he was answering his comm. I thought he was going to wait for me to go in so I could clear the place out. This is base command to Liggett. I just heard from Agent Chance. His injuries are extensive. You are now primary on this mission. Is Chance going to recover? He'll live. Whether he'll come back on duty, I don't know. Keyword automatophobia. Your new objective is to retrieve the ultra wave transmitter from Kai Sazen. I still want the Jedi taken down if possible, but she can't be our priority. I'm on my way to Kai Sazen's hideout now. May the Force be with you. Base command out. I've cut short some of the audio on there. Or just changed the script and didn't... and forgot to tell the person who uh, put in the subtitles. Stand by what I said. <laughs> We'd like to talk at some point. Yeah, well, I'm not ready to talk just yet. Is there a fanatic in there? Please tell me there's a fanatic. Yes, there is.
Dang it, I don't want to go in there just yet. There we are, fanatic. The chances are if I go in there I lose this uh, bonus mission. <laughs> Execute tactical advantage to drop a canister that fills the vicinity with poisonous gas. And AOE attack. Nice. But, um, where's. That's AOE as well. Well, that's. Actually, let's put that up there, that there, and that there. Cool. Thank you, Ogorog. Increasing combat pheromones. The song of the universe becomes cacophonous. Be wary. Funny. When the Nikto said a girl was coming after me, <laughs> I thought she'd be a challenge. And when I heard a Jedi was leading a Nikto cult, I thought she'd be older than twelve. It is her. She who killed my brothers. Easy, Fentar. We can call each other names, but I'm about to become ruler of all Terrace. And then, when I own this place, I'll take my cult and my rackles and make a nasty little paradise for anyone who swears loyalty. You want to rule a world? It's my destiny. You wouldn't understand, but then, neither does the Republic. Kutogi Goomba. Gigi no Lia Makichisa. Not now. I'm going to deal with you. I am going to kill you. And then back to business. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. You won't die. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take out you sir. Just because I can. <laughs> and dead. Oh, you cheating little. Ugh. The Nikto said you were good, but I'm still their savior. When I'm gone, they'll sing the death song of Threshalu. What do you say to that? strong, ambitious, and you have no loyalty to the Republic. There's a place for you in the Empire. <laughs> Are you... Is that why you came all this way? To stop me and then recruit me when I'm down? Your position among the Sith would be secure. The only price I ask is the Ultrawave Transmitter. My ticket to freedom. I could live with being called Lord Sazen. The Nikto will retrieve your payment. But I need to go, before the Republic comes to see what all the fuss is about. Oscar Stupa! <laughs> That's a funky looking rack. Ooh. Uh, rather ripped. How 
invigorating. Well, now that's interesting. Cypher, I hope you don't mind that I freed myself. I wanted the chance to look through Kai Sazen's research. I think you owe me an explanation. Y yes, I, I was hoping to smooth things over by re recovering the ultra wave transmitter for you, but you clearly didn't need the help. Your scent is purely human. How? You're understandably suspicious. As soon as we distance ourselves from the Republic Army, I promise to answer all your questions. Rendezvous at the Imperial Command Center. And don't get killed on the way. I'll do my very best. Alright. So, back to here. Toxic Lake. Hang on, no, what? No, Toxic Lake. That's where we're going. Dr. Loken. Cypher. I'd like to make a proposal. For five minutes, you and I pretend to trust one another. We lay our cards on the table. No lies, no hidden recorders. Just truth. Why don't you start by telling me why you're on Taris? I've been studying the Rack Ghouls for some time. I came to Taris to review the research of others. The same research Kai Sazen stole. My goal was to perfect a custom strain of the Rakgul virus. The keyed to my own genetic structure, it currently allows free reversion between human and Rakgul forms. I don't understand. You wanted to become a Rakgul? There are advantages. Consider an unarmed operative who could enter a secure location and grow teeth. I'm merely a test subject. Of course, our superiors wouldn't agree with my choice of personal projects. It seems both of us lied about being sent here by Imperial Intelligence. That's a very interesting theory. Maybe you should explain. I don't think too much elaboration is wise. But your unusual contact, your search for the ultrawave transmitter, I understand, Cypher, that working without official sanction can be a necessary evil. But given what we know about one another, I think I ought to stay close to you. An alliance rather than mutual destruction. We keep an eye on each other and our secrets stay hidden. Maybe we'll even get some work done. I'll gather my belongings and meet you on board. Oh, and one last thing. About the ultrawave transmitter. You know that Nason Gadera was notorious for hiding secrets in his devices. Encrypted codes, maps to lost projects. Just something I heard. I'll see you shortly. He's an odd man, and there's something in his eyes. We'll watch him. Ooh. All right, so now we've got Dr. Logan. Am I going the right way? Yes, I am. See what the next mission is. It 
it's in your head. You can't keep it there. This is Leggett to Base Command. I have retrieved the Ultra Wave transmitter. Base Command here. Connect the Gadara device to your link up. I'll download what I need. I got word Kai says an escaped terrorist. Took a shuttle headed for Imperial space. She had too many guards. By the time I got through them, it was either her or the transmitter. Damnation. Not everyone's fit to be a Jedi. The Order's practically asking them to fall. And then... Download's complete. Let's hope the genius in that thing helps us win this war. It's breaking your skull. Can you hear it crack? You don't look so good, Leggett. Take a few days. Check in with your bosses. We'll have another job soon. <laughs> What is going on? <laughs> Can you see? What the hell? Cypher 9. Leggett. Disposable operative. It's been a while since Shadow Town. I can't move. I can barely think. What's going on? When you met me on Nasha Da, I was designated Watcher X, formerly Watcher 5, formerly Minder 8. I performed surgery on you, do you remember? A chip in your spine to disguise your life readings. Maybe that chip is how we're talking now, or maybe it's the stress. Double agent, triple agent. The brainwashing damages your mind. The SIS knows about the programming. I can't even talk about it. I was in your position once, trapped by my conditioning, forced to subvert it. I warned you they'd do the same to you. The SIS isn't to blame. We both know you were programmed before you met them. The Republic doesn't have the technology. Brainwashing is an Imperial science. Yes. Slave serums, genetic engineering, killic pheromones. But this, I don't recognize. If you want freedom, if you want revenge, we need more information. Imperial Intelligence will have records on Drummond Kars. Take your personnel files from the Citadel archives. Ensure no one sees you. You have no allies now. <laughs> Readings are stable. Ah, our patient is awake. We found you in the plague sleep. We watched, but could not mend you. I appreciate the thought, but I'll be all right. Just exhausted. No, you're not. But this isn't the hive, and we can't hear your thoughts. We respect your privacy. It's been a while since I played ship's doctor. There is something odd here, Cypher. Alright, so drum and cast first. How are we looking? Yep. Alright, cool. So we're off to drum and cast. and see if we can see what's in my file next time.